welcome back. And we're back with another recap video. Yay. WWE Survivor Series. Yes. And oh man, we're yeah. all devastated. Yeah, it had its ups and downs. It was intense. Yeah, my dad said this probably was the better pay-per-view than the last pay-per-view. Why don't we just say it? Raw won, hands down. SmackDown got their butts handed to them. Yeah. Well, let me just say a match that pretty much was just a kickoff match that pretty much wasn't really... It don't count. Period. But... Which it should since it was Raw vs. SmackDown. Tag Team SmackDown, Usos, New Day, The Clones, The Club, and Insanity. First Tag Team Raw, Rude Gable, Lucha House Friday, Revival, B-Team, and Ascension. Um, the Soul Survivors were the Usos. They pinned the Revival. Doing tribute to their cousin Roman Reigns. Yeah, I believe that. Mm -hmm. Um, that match was so good. Okay, match, I mean, didn't <clears throat> get us. Ooh, 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 I knew SmackDown was going to win. Yeah. But, um. It don't count. But that was that match. Scoreboard, 6-0. to zero. But here we go. The first official match was the Raw Smack and SmackDown's women's division match. Tag team. Elimination chamber. Chamber. Elimination tag team. It should have been an elimination chamber. <laughs> but anyway. But then again, everyone would have been devastated. So, for Team SmackDown, we have Carmella, Naomi, Mandy Rose, Sonya Deville, and Asuka. Yeah, you're going for Mandy Rose. She shouldn't even be in it. I can't stand Mandy Rose. What has she done to deserve a spot on it? That should have been someone else. Someone with talent. Okay. Freaking Lana so has more talent than Mandy Rose. Mandy Rose is just there for looks. Okay, Rawls. And now for the Rawls team. Bailey and Sasha, which they were added in the in the in the beginning of the show, so they were last minute entries. And we have Nia Jax and Tamina, Mickey James, and the captain of the team, Bliss. Yeah, it was backstage before, and Bliss said be on the team. So Bailey and Sa Sasha was like, "Okay, we'll do it," just so we could devastate SmackDown. Because they did invade Raw. But afterwards, they're coming after the, everyone else. So, yeah. But, um... That match had some little funny moments. Like Carmella doing little, the five-second dance-off. Nia Jax throws her out. Yeah. Um, and... But the last person in was Asuka, and she was fighting Sasha Banks and Nia Jax. Yep. Yeah. And she eliminated Sasha Banks because Nia Jax shoved Sasha off the turnbuckle. Yep. That and was then, another one, not off my chair, but yeah. Yeah, it was a Raw won that one. So is my own Nia Jax. Now, for the Intercontinental versus the United States match. Is uh, Seth Rollins versus Shinsuke Nakamura. Go on, say it. Do it. Come on. Yes. Yeah. Come on. He was, but, burn it down. Totally won that. But you know what? Ashley upset because no Dean Ambrose sightings at all. No, but at least Dean didn't hurt Seth. No, nope. Dean did not show up at all. But, yeah. it's, um, there was a little interview after Seth Rollins, yep. um, won. They said that TLC, TLC is match. going to be Seth Rollins. First, Dean Ambrose for the Intercontinental Championship. I'm sorry, Rollins. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rollins. I'm going Dean. You know what? Why wear a Rollins shirt when you're a Dean fangirl? Because I like all of them. I like mm -hmm. all the Shield members. Even if they're not a Shield anymore, I still like every individual. You just said that no matter what, Dean's still your favorite. So, your favoritism, Dean, Dean's over everyone else. One. Seth's number two, Roman's last. Nah, Roman's number one in my book. Then it's Dean and then it's Seth. So, um... So, like, yeah. 
Now for the tag team match. Okay. <laughs> now we got... The tag team champions. Do, 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 do. Tag, Smackdown tag champions of the bar with Big Show. First of all, tag team champions, AOP with their little manager. Oh, that was funny. Oh, that was funny. Yeah, it was. Funny. The bar would have won if that didn't happen. Go on, say it, Ash. Oh, man. <laughs> who's, the, who's the guy in the, in the who's their manager? Oh, he's his t- name? he's the manager on 205, right? Yeah, he's the manager on 205. I forgot his name. Let's see. He was running around. But he was like, and then he was on the uh, ring, and then Big Show was staring at him with the bar in the. No, he the Big Show gr- picked him up in his hand, holding him in the, by the throat, and during the whole time, he's he made he made him piss his pants. He made that he little tiny guy pee his pants, and during the whole time, the bar and the Big Show. Kept staring, and then AOP freaking did their tag team move, and they won. Uh, I was like, I was like, oh man. Uh, he's probably like, I peed myself, but at least my team won. Distraction. Ew. Victory, victory for a comedic moment. Raw, three wins in a row. Yep. And we were hoping that the next match would have won, but. It was a little intermission because this was a 205 match. Yeah. Which usually shouldn't that be in the kickoff? Yeah, should they should have put Buddy Murphy. Someone Murphy. wasn't doing their job. They should have put the Cruiserweight in the kickoff and the SmackDown tag in here. They should have done that. Yeah, yeah. instead of switching it. So here, that's the little controversy. But it's Buddy Murphy versus mm-hmm. Mustafa Ali for the Cruiserweight belt. I was hoping for Mustafa Ali. Yep. But I think it's because Buddy Murphy um, just got the title, so they're going to let him have the title for a while. Are you sure it's not because he's dating Alexa Bliss? No. A WWE superstar? Took from, oh, yep. Yeah, I think he took from such a great. Who did he take from? So wouldn't that be a um, Raw victory? Are you talking about Buddy Murphy? How he got the... Yeah, I'm trying to say... Critical Cedric Alexander. Cedric, I was right. Cedric Alexander. Where do you get critical? <laughs> it's Cedric. But, um... Buddy Isn't Murphy that... beat Mustafa Ali. That match was... As it was a good match, Mustafa actually put up a fight against Buddy Murphy. And how that was a okay match, actually. He had put up a fight against him. So. Mm-hmm. What did you think about that? That was good. But, uh, Oh, Missy, you picked. The, you call this match. Okay, Missy. It is our male Raw superstars match. Team Raw versus SmackDown. So why don't you you tell us the Team Raw? Before that, there was a thing in the backstage with Braun Strowman. He's sitting there telling everyone they better pull no, their weight and that. And um, he's like he was like telling Finn. Like, you know, he does not, you know, he does he likes him, but not like the other ones. And um, he was talking about that little shrimpy. Oh, my gosh. And then remember he picked up, uh... Yeah, because, um, <laughs> they were laughing. Uh, Dolphin, you said something about Braun Strowman. And then, um, Baron Corbin's like, well... And then he gets in his face, ah, you can't touch me. You can't <laughs> nope. touch me. He's like, all right, for all for now. I'll just do this. Takes a little rest and throws it on Barry yeah, Corbin. Yeah, that was awesome. And, and then, the funny thing is, our truth comes in. And then when Barry, everybody's all ruckus, and our truth's like, "Hey, we need to get on the same page." And everybody's staring at him like, and "You're not him. even on this team. Get out!" <laughs> yep. And then we have the Raw, the um, SmackDown team. Yeah, and then I think that they had one with SmackDown too when they were talking, and then our <laughs> truth. Coming in there too and saying, "I want to, I want to ask for a SmackDown contract." And Shane's like, "You're ready on the SmackDown roster." Oh, good because Raw is crazy. And it's like, oh god, we made our truth a fun character. He's just a joke. Yeah, he's nothing but a joke. You can't take him seriously. He ain't gonna be no champion. But anyway, Missy, name the matches up. So we have Team Raw first, which is freaking Baron Corbin. That's the team you like captain. him, Missy. That's <sighs> the stupid team captain. Bobby freaking Lashley with his little shrimpy on the side. Um, 
Finn Balor, um, Dolph Ziggy Wiggy, um, Drew Frickin' McIntyre, whatever. If she says Frickin', and, it means these are guys who she wants. And also, Braun Strowman. Get these hands. Yeah, and then for Team SmackDown, we have The Miz, who's the team captain. Um, Jeff Hardy, Flubba Bubba Samoa Joey, um, Rey Mysterio, um, and Shane McMahon. And while I was shocked, Samoa Joe was the first one to get eliminated. Well, well, no, well, first, before we say that, it was Braun Strowman arguing with Drew McIntyre on who's yeah. going to face Joe, and then, for, then it was Braun going to start, then McIntyre just slaps him on the shoulder, tagging himself in. And then out of nowhere, Joe just comes in Coquina Clutch. And then he gets out of the Coquina Clutch. And then Coquina clutches McIntyre again. McIntyre gets out, kicks Joe in the face, and then pins him. One, two, three. Joe is instantly out. That was like within, what, uh, under a minute? Yeah. That's right. Joe's a minute man. And I he gets out. I can see Finn Balor really did a lot. Not. Yeah, Finn did pretty good in yeah. that match, too. Oh, man, but with Shane? Shane, he was getting a little wobbly. Yeah. And Miz was making him... Uh, no, tell us with all the moments with Shane. Like, at the one moment... Okay, Shane went on the top rope and did uh, an elbow drop to Braun Strowman on the announce table. Then, he's a wobbly, wiggly, wow. And then Miz had who, who's it called? Dolph Ziggler in the corner holding him. Tag Shane to do that. Oh, the coast to coast. Poof. poof. And, and then, he did it twice. And then the third time, the third time when he was going to do coast to coast, Braun Strowman right hooks him at the rope, knocking Shane down. That was funny. Didn't you yeah, see awesome. Shane's face? Baron freaking Corbin outside the ring, like, yeah, yeah, come on, come on, trying to. Happy was his team members. So Baron, you won't be ha yeah, yeah, happy when uh, you get those hands. Yeah, he's gonna get them tomorrow. Hey, tough with Star Series, you can yeah. touch them. Mhm. Mm um, was, but wasn't um Strowman the, the one that won the match for them? Yeah, he won the match. Yep. He pinned Shane. Cause Shane was the only one left on that team. Shane still, even though he was all fudged up, could barely stand. He still fought. But then again, Braun Strowman it gave him a mercy killing. Yep, the only one left on Raw was Braun, Bobby, and Drew. Yeah, and then during the, when Braun is soaking up his victory, freaking Baron Corbin just attacks him, uh, he just outright hits him in the back. Yeah. But then again, remember, the match was the pay per view isn't over. And then like he was like wanting him to come back down the ramp because he was all the way up at the top of the ramp, and he, Baron Corbin was like doing this, like yeah, like he kept kept teasing him. Yeah, he won't. Wait till he gets his yeah, hands. Yeah, he he's, he's getting them. He's getting them tomorrow. Yep. Yep. But the next match was Charlotte versus Ronda Rousey. And what was Ronda Rousey's makeup on her oh, eyes? Oh, no, that Ugh. was weird. Is it Black, but Black Swan? Isn't that what she's doing? The Natalie Portman thing? But that match actually was, was another really, really It was like good a match. Thank you, Charlotte. It was Thank intense. you. Thank you. I'm sorry, I don't like Ronda Rousey right now. It was intense. It was back and forth. Charlotte did some co cool stuff. Ronda Rousey was, you know, trying to reverse her way out. But then again, Sh Rousey won via disqualification because what happened? Charlotte kind of snapped. Yeah, she, um... She hit her with Dean Ambrose's favorite weapon, the kendo stick. She was just smacking with the candlestick, cat and snap. Candlestick, 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 candlestick. Till it broke, and she kept whacking her, and then she got another candlestick. Also, before that, Rhonda was bleeding, and then she bleeded on her head and yeah. stuff. There was a lot of blood. Because, um, because, uh, Charlotte elbowed her in the face. Yeah. And then she got the, um, the chair in the ring. They were, they were really going at it before the, before that. Yeah, like, um. They did that, she tried to do the eight. The figure eight. Tried to do the figure eight. Then, um. Ronda reversed it. I'm trying to make uh, Charlotte Tad and then roll it and they roll the ring. This and that. And it was intense. It was just a lot of moves. Yeah, and then, then she Ronda, snapped. Ronda kept trying to put her in the arm bar. No. Sasha <laughs> kept... No. Charlotte kept winning. She was so, she was not expecting someone to be so flexible, was she? 
Because Becky Lynch did tell her, do what I would do. Yep. And she did? She kind of snapped. Yep. She and then she, um, she probably broke her neck or something with the chair. She put it on the thing and then she just stumped on it. So, yeah, so that made a DQ, so Ronda Rousey won that. But everyone's cheering for Charlotte. Man, everybody was like, thank you, Charlotte. Oh, of course. Rousey doesn't belong in WWE. Yeah, they thought that she was told to leave because she was going to hit her with the chair, but then and she yeah, went she out. Yeah, she went around and then... She did the... Um, selection? That's, how, that's how she did the neck thing. Yep. No, after that, then she put the chair around Ronda's neck and then stomped on it. Yep. Yep. And they told her... Attacking the refs? Yeah. No, there was a whole bunch of refs and Charlotte just went nuts. Then they got security. <sighs> Sorry, got a cold. So yeah, good job, Charlotte. And then, uh, yeah, so Ronda Rousey was, you know, they checked her and tried to give her water and everything. They were like, they were, some of the fans were screaming, you deserved it, and she was telling them to shut up. She gave the pouty, the pouty face, but the before, pouty doggy face. Charlotte before, also was saying she was the baddest bee in the, in the world. Mm-hmm. And the, now, the for our main man. event. Was Justin... Daniel Bryan versus Brock Lesnar. And everybody even said this. It was going to be a slaughter. Brock Lesnar was going to was going to kill Daniel Bryan. I thought fat at, at least at first, we thought. But then, ooh, Daniel Bryan actually... He actually made sure that Brock Lesnar became overconfident. It was going to be a one-sided match. And then... For some reason, the stupid ref got in the middle of the F5, got knocked out, and then Daniel Bryan reversed it. Gave Brock Lesnar the low blow, which actually turned the tide in the match. Yeah, it made it actually an intense match. I thought the Fat Penguin, I thought he was supposed to say he was going to sit in the audience. What the heck happened to that? No, he was sitting inside. Sitting, sitting inside. Yeah, but he kept screaming at Brock Lesnar. and then he was just... like... It was just intense. And yeah, he kept going like he was shocked. And he was like, come on, come on, Lesnar, Lesnar. And then we yeah. see Daniel Bryan actually going for the knees of Lesnar, taking him to the uh, the ring post, damaging it, which limited, which injured Brock Lesnar from doing the F5s, which he needs. And then they kept reversing each other's moves. Daniel Bryan got a few kicks in. Yeah, he got him in his um, yes lock. Uh, Brock got out of he it. He almost t- no, he almost tapped. Yeah. He even kicked him in the nads too, yeah. or punched him in the nads. I don't remember. No, he kicked him. We already said that. That's what. Co- which, I know. That's the thing which ta- which gave Daniel Bryan the edge. If he didn't do it, it would have. It, it, Brock would have won that hands down. But eventually, Brock gave the F five to um, Daniel Bryan, and he which. Won. You know, yeah. But that was not a one-sided match. That thing could have gone either way. Six. Yeah. Two. Raw. This pretty much was Raw Survivor Series. At least they got one victory. I mean, let us know what you thought of Survivor Series. What did you like? Name your matches from... What do you think is going to happen tomorrow? Your favorite to your least. Yeah. Are you safe for Raw? Are you safe to see what's going to happen on Raw? Because I guarantee Raw is going to be interesting since they won this pay-per-view. Especially- Baron Corbin, you're getting these hands. Yep. So, I, I, I think so. I, I'm looking forward to it, seeing Raw. All right, so, uh, so, so let's, let's know. So. What, what was your, like, really, like, what was your favorite match? Like, what was your favorite match? Name your match from le- uh, favorite to the least. We're repeating, Which aren't one? we? So, why not? So. Like, what was, like, your intense? What you thought was intense? Which was your favorite? I decided to see Dean Ambrose and Rollins at TLC. So, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.